Eagle Square in Nigeria's capital Abuja usually hosts concerts, rallies and even presidential inaugurations. But since the onset of the global health crisis, it has a new role, punishing those who break the rules. It's the site for one of several pop-up courts that are being deployed across the country. They can be dismantled each day and moved to new locations. Unemployed graduate Martin Uka is one of those brought by police to appear before a judge for breaking rules such as mask wearing, social distancing and limiting gatherings. Actually sitting and waiting for a job interview actually, when they came in to arrest me. So I never knew they were up to this show. And if not, I was having my fixed marks on me. He and several dozen others are fined 3,000 naira, or nearly eight US dollars, with an option of community service. They are arguably lucky. Under the law, they could be jailed for up to six months. Uka says he will be careful in the future. I don't really feel bad, like I know I'm, I'm paying for my sins, actually. Rights groups have warned that arbitrary enforcement of the rules could lead to rights abuses. But the government is adamant that there should be no let up on the rules, even as it rolls out vaccines. Africa's most populous nation started vaccinations last week after receiving nearly 4 million doses through the World Health Organization's COVAX scheme.